Hey everybody, how are you? I pray and trust that wherever you are, that you're giving God thanks as I always like to say. And um, I'm just going to give you a little tour. I'm going to give you a little tour of my facility here in the Cayman Islands, um, Health Solutions. I know that many persons keep asking, what is Health Solution? What is it about? And so I'm just going to give you a quick, nice little tour um, of um, my facility. I've been um, doing colon therapy, detoxing. Um, we would call it medical massages, reflexology. Been doing all of those things since 2007. Um, many of you would have known, or well, not many of you, not all of you, but many persons would have known that I was the first person of its kind to open a center in um, Port Moore, in Port Moore, St. Catherine, Jamaica. And so um, I, I was blessed to be endorsed by the Minister of Health, also in Jamaica, as a naturopathic practitioner and um, you know also call on care specialists praise God God bless you Bishop Samuel and so I'm gonna just be giving you all a quick tour of my my facility here in the Cayman Islands um, when I do come in I work strictly by appointments I don't do walk-ins unless I am definitely free because most times I'm full of booked um, I speak into churches, I speak at events, um, I speak about health. Um, if there was ever a time that the body of Christ needs to know more about healthy lifestyles, eating habits, and um, the benefits of water, coconut water, the danger of living in an acidic state versus an alkaline state, um, you know, a lot of times people see me in Jamaica and um, because I am not um, doing any further business in Jamaica as far as my holistic and naturopathic practitioner, um, practitioner is concerned, um, I don't make a big deal because a lot of people will call in asking when I'm opening back and when I'm starting back, um, but I have to be led by the Spirit of God. And so here in Cayman, um, thank God over the years, um, not only just being a med-surg nurse, not only training in, um, in um, surgery and those things, but um, since 2007, I went on to do my training through the Alternative Medicine College of Canada to earn myself um, a naturopathic diploma certified naturopathic consultant, certified educator, health educator. And hence, um, in 20, I think it was about 20, 2009, then I opened my facility here in the Cayman Islands. So I'm gonna give you a quick tour. And I'm located in the Dolphin Center in, on Eastern Avenue in Georgetown, Grand Cayman. And as I said before, I work, I, strictly appointments, I don't do walk-ins, and I have my reason for that, because I have to prep people, I have to educate people, I have to make sure that I do a proper consultation with you, I don't just take you in like that. I am a professional, and I operate as a professional, and I have to protect myself also, because I went through a lot to be endorsed here in the Cayman Islands, I have to go through all my business licenses, yearly and all of that kind of thing and I give God thanks. So I'm going to turn the camera around and give you just a brief, brief tour of um, you know my facility here. As a matter of fact I'm just taking a break because I've just gotten through you know with clients and what have you so I'm just going to take a break before I go on. <laughs> so yeah well you would have entered you know you would have come in. I'm in the, I'm in the um, Dolphin Center here um, you know, in, um, well, we say a flow van there. And so once you come into the door of Health is Solution, this is what you're going to 
you know, buck up into. Yes, you're going to come in, and um, depending on what you're coming for, um, then you will fill out your intake sheet. Um, this here is just a little idea about um, the uh, foot um, detox, the ionic foot detox. It's a potent um, um, antioxidant, and also it helps to re-energize and, you know, to boost your cellular level. And we deal with the pH balance, and as I said, cellular conductivity. And um, the irons actually helps to rejuvenate the entire system. So I'm shooting here from Healthy Solutions. Um, this would have been some of my certification, diplomas in the various areas. Um, here is some of my machines where persons would do the ionic foot detox. And um, uh, these are just some educational material. These are some of my machines here for the ionic foot detox. And as you can see, I have a full wall and this is just some of them. Um, this is when I went to New York in Garden City um, to do some of my trainings with GI doctors, gastroenterologists, hepatologists. This is Dr. Chris Demetrio, one of the leading hepatologists in New York in Garden City. I went and I did my training with them. Here is my training also with the GI doctors as um, Cole Lavage. I do preps for colonoscopists and those kind of things. And um, when you come in, you do have to um, do an intake. You have to fill out um, an intake, just if you would do with an MD. And um, as I said before, here is a sheet also where I describe to persons about the digestive tract. We're dealing with the bloodstream, then it goes to the liver, and then you end up with what you call systemic toxicity and those kind of things. So I'm just giving you a little rundown here at Healthy Solutions. As I said, once you enter the door, it's a beautiful uh, facility. I'm going to take you now into, um, into the colon room. So once persons are in here, they're quite relaxed and um, uh, we, you know, you're very, very much educated. Once you come in, I try my best to educate you. Um, the colon and the brain works hand in hand. Here you see your entire body. Your entire system is locked into the colon. It's locked. This is would be where your colon would be. And your entire system, your brains, every part of you is locked into your colon. So this is the nervous system. All of your nerves, every part of you from foot, yeah, from your head to your toe, your spinal cord. Uh -huh. And here we have the snaps, the nerves, and it's a lot of deep stuff. I major in anatomy and physiology, so I can tell you about these things. So I hope that you're enjoying this, because a lot of people didn't know that about me. Um, you know, I, a lot of people didn't know a lot of these things about me. And so I just lay low, and when it's time, then I do. I'm going to show you something else. Here you see this would be abnormalities of the digestive system. Here's your appendix. There's a um, fecal matter in there. And that's what causes appendicitis. If it bursts, it will kill you. Yes, and we look at gallstones and uh, um, gallbladder um, and gall duct. We look at the stomach, all the various things that happens in the stomach. You understand? Um, gastric ulcers and all of those things. We look at diverticulitis, which we call diver diverticulosis. And that's when feces um, get into, um, secrete into the lumen and bulge out. Here's your hemorrhoids. Yeah, people call them port pile. And that has to do with straining. And you have your internal hemorrhoids or external hemorrhoids. I'm giving you a lot of good stuff here today, right? This would be uh, my bucket for when I'm ready to do coffee enemas to stimulate the liver. Um, here we see the cardiovascular system, just like with the nervous system. Here is would be where your colon would be. And here you see again, from your foot, go right up to your brains is your entire blood, is blood system, um, red oxygenated, blue deoxygenated blood, your heart. So every part of you is locked into your colon. Every part of you is locked into your colon. Small intestine, we don't touch that. We deal, we, um, we deal with the large, 
we deal with the large intestine. This is your large intestine. Your colon begins on your right side and then uh, continues on to your left. So we have the ascending transverse and descending colon, your liver, stomach, lungs, and all the good stuff. There's more diplomas, more of my diplomas. So here we see, this is beautiful right here. Here you see all your blood vessels, every part of you. Here you see the liver. And this is where the liver is the major detoxification organ apart from your skin. And we see that everything is locked into the colon. So a lot of times people think that, oh, I, I'm not constipated, so I don't need to do no colon therapy because I'm not constipated. I want you to know that your breast, when it comes to asthma, when it comes to hay fever, when it comes to calcium deficiency, all of those kind of things happens because of a compacted um, colon. When it comes to the male reproductive organs, when it comes to the genitalia areas with the prostate, the colon could be resting on the prostate. And when it comes to diabetes with your sugar level, all of these things has to do your vitamin deficiency, your eyes, tonsil, ears. Every part of you is locked into the colon. All right, so these are some of my material kits. I use disposable things. I don't use any reusable things on persons. When you come in, you're going to be prepped. You're going to be educated. You're going to be given a disposable gown, just like you would. Um, it's very professional, very, very professional, what I do here. Very professional, yes. So we're going to go now after that, after you're through um, in the colon um, once you're finished in the colon room, then you're going to come off of the bed. You're going to come off the bed safely, step on your little stool, and you're going to come off of the bed. And this is the machine. And don't forget, I use strictly filtered warm water. Um, I educate you about your eating habits. And I use filtered warm water. And, um, you know, we definitely just do everything professionally. Once there's my basin, wash my hands. <laughs> That's my coat. <laughs> and so once you come out, you go through this door. And then you enter into another area. Um, now you go into the bathroom. And this is where, um, well, you can see me there, right? In my nice uniform. Hey, everybody. Praise the Lord. Yes. And um, once, you, once you come out, um, you, go in, you go into the bathroom, and then that's when heaven comes down. That's when all of my work, all of my labor comes to proof that what you just did was powerful and good for you, where we cleanse the colon. And I know a lot of people will say, oh, well, you know, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not constipated. I go every morning. Oh, you could be going every morning, and there is still stuff in the rugaes. There is still stuff in lodged in the pockets. You know, um, I did a lady earlier, and if you saw the amount of mucus, the amount of, the amount of um, um, you know, plaque that came off of the wall of her colon, the lumps of, um, of, 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 of parasites, candida albicans, where it was hitched on, sucking in there, making you feel lethargic and drained, and you know, all those kind of things, and, and what have you. And so, colon hydrotherapy, brothers and sisters, ladies and gentlemen, is one of the best things anybody can do for themselves. You know, understand? Somebody, was, somebody asked me this morning, Dr. Fagan, I feel so good. How often can I do this? I say, listen, this is just water. You're doing yourself a favor when you do colonics and you do it with a trained, qualified person. Don't forget that um, if you come in and I go through your consultation with you and I really believe that you should not or you're not a candidate for colonics, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. It's not about money for me. It's about your safety. It's about you making sure that you are ready for this. There are persons who have come in. I'm just gonna lean here. There are persons who have come in and they would have come in and said, I will have to get their history. And because of my medical knowledge and what have you, then I would have to say to them, I'm sorry, but I'd need you to go and um, see your MD and get a release. I've had medical doctors that call me and um, you know, we discuss things and what have you. So um, bear in mind, I'm not an MD. I'm a naturopathic doctor. I'm a naturopathic in my own alternative medicine, that is. So I'm not like the MDs. I don't prescribe medication. I don't 
tell people not to take their medication because I have knowledge and I know there is um, a time and place for everything but I would educate persons on, on what, what they can do to help their body to get to that place to where the body can heal itself. You know, I have a book called Let Food Be Your Medicine. I have four books out. Um, praise God, they're selling locally. I think they're in several bookstores in Jamaica also. And so it's, it's important that people understand the power of detoxification. A lot of people is fixing up the hair, you know, fixing up the nails, especially ladies. But when it comes to the inside, they're rottening. You understand, rottening. That's why when they uh, pass win, <laughs> it is it it have to blow up the whole place because that is food that has been petrified. In other words, it is it is staying in there. It's rottening, and you could be going religiously every day, as I said before, and you're still constipated. You understand. A lot of times, people will take things what they would call wash out. Or when you take a wash out, what that's going to do because of the amount of water, it's going to soften up some stool. And it's just going to run on the side of the stool and come out. The constipation is still there. There is certain there, there is certain things that a colonic does that you... And you've got to remember, an enema just deals with the lower section of, of, of the rectum. An enema just deals with the anus. It's just dealing with that little section right there. The anus is where the stool is stored. After we defecate, after we... Go to the bathroom and do do if you will then right away stuff works its way down and it stores there until you're ready to go again so most naturally when you do an enema you would just be washing out that area but um there the 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 the, the, the way that you do a colonic is that we um we, we put in water slowly we put in water slowly we take out, the first thing the machine does is remove all the gas, you know, from, um, you know, let me just show you that, all of, all of the, you know, the bloating that, that sometimes could be in our tummy, you understand? The first thing that the colonic does is, 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 is remove all of that puffiness. People come in here with their belly out like this, when they leave their belly flat, you understand? And no, I don't wear girdles, never wore one in my life. <laughs> I don't wear all those ban up, ban up things. I don't do that. No, no, no. That's deceiving yourself. That's deceiving yourself because at the end of the day, it is still there. So I don't, I don't, I don't get into that. I, I, I don't do those things. All right. And so, like I said, this so this is the bathroom where you know we have the basin, hand towel. And um, even have a clock that people can tell how long they've been on the toilet. And um, yeah, everything is clean. I'm going to show you something that you don't hardly see in much facilities. I can touch this. I will hold this. And we have people coming from all over using this bathroom. But I will touch it. You know why? Because I disinfect properly. I disinfect properly. I disinfect everything. I disinfect the light switch. I disinfect the doorknobs. Anything that I think that a person might have touched, I disinfect. All right. And so um, there's something else I wanted to show you about the colon. Um, like I said, this would be the rectum area. So we find that stuff is stored in the rectum. Um, there is a place on the colon called the sigmoid colon. And if you look under your sink, you will see that it's the shape of under your face base, or your sink. Now, when I talked about the rugas, we're talking about, um, you know, the pockets, that stuff can always be in the pockets. So I just wanted you to have a little clue and to get an idea of um, what it's like. So once a person um, leaves, leaves, leaves in here, once a person leaves the bed and comes and goes to the bathroom, then automatically the store is shut. And then when they're finished, then they'll come out and head back out and uh, head to their destination. All right. So I trust that you have, you know, did well. And these are some of my books. I'm just writing up some 
some patients that I have here. And um, these are some of my books. As I said before, I have a book called Let Food Be Your Medicine. I have another book called The Natural Health Benefits of Coconut Oil, Coconut Water, Coconut Jelly. I have one called The Menopause Manual for Men and Women. Men is andropause, women is menopause. But the book is written so that the men can understand what women go through while they're having a change of life. And then we also have the one called Relieving Irritable Bowel Syndrome. Naturally, a lot of people are suffering from bowel syndrome and don't even realize that they're suffering from bowel syndrome, from irritable bowel syndrome. And that's when um, you eat something and, you know, you start griping right away. And... Um, and you gotta keep going to the bathroom. It's like you're, you're, you're like a duck. You can't keep anything inside of you. So I pray and trust that you have been all wonderfully blessed by um, what I just did here. Um, like I said, I work by appointments only. Um, my WhatsApp, globally, wherever, I'm 1876 783 2378. That is 1876-783-2378. my WhatsApp. Whether I'm in the Cayman Islands, Jamaica, wherever, you can always get me on that WhatsApp. My local number in the Cayman Islands, that is 345-929-6151. Uh, Praise the Lord. And I just want to thank you, Bishop. This is the work of Bishop Fagan's hand. Bishop Fagan is the one who designed this place, who uh, made sure the machines and everything. As a matter of fact, Bishop Fagan... Also flew to Juno Beach, Florida to get training, um, to get special training as it pertains to the Dutola machine. And so he's the one that actually um, makes sure that the machine is, is functioning, up and running. And also he's trained also in the detox machines. So I thank God for also my boopsie. Praise the Lord. So if you're in the Cayman Islands, if you have not made your appointment, I don't do walk-ins, strictly appointments. Um, you can give me a call at 345-929-6150. No WhatsApp on that number. I won't get it. No WhatsApp on that number. My WhatsApp number is 1876-78323. Um, um, 783. Oh Lord, let me see if I get it right now. 1876-783-2378. Yes, and like I said before, for those of you that are just hopping on, I'm just showing you my facility here in the Cayman Islands, and I'll just give you back a quick walk through. Um, quickly, 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 quickly. Yes, uh, praise God. Colon room. Yes, this is the colonic room, all the disposables. And like I said earlier, person, once they're finished on the bed, once they've had their colonics and they're educated, Praise God, then they enter through this door and they go straight to the bathroom. And once they're finished in the bathroom, then they come out and they come straight out. And that's how it works. All right. So until next time, I'll come back with some more training, some more educational material. And so I want to say God bless all of you. God bless all of you. Till next time. Shalom. Peace.